Hi everyone, welcome back to Jamra TV and season greetings to you and your family from my family to yours Today we're going to make a Jamaican traditional drink a drink that we have this time of the year mainly um, it's called sorry it's something that you can enjoy cold with a slice of fruit cake or if you want to say a rum cake yeah and or you can have it with your Christmas dinner you know something that we normally have at this time of year to enjoy a nice cold drink not the normal drink that you used to every day alright so I'll see you guys in a bit when we're gonna prepare that drink hi guys welcome back so we have our water here on the stove. We have our um, sorry, or a lot of people know it as dry hibiscus, but in the Caribbean we say sorry. Yeah. So I'm using three cups of three cups of sorry, right? And the water. How much water I'm gonna use? I'm gonna use nine cups of water. So I'm using the ratio of. Um, Water to soil to water is like one cup of soil, three cup of water. Yeah. So make sure you wash your soil properly. Yeah. Before you add it to the water. So I'm gonna go ahead now and add my wash soil. And you don't have to use the exact measurement as I use. This is just what my choice, right? After I add my sorrow or my hibiscus dried hibiscus to the um, pot I'm gonna go ahead and add two pieces of um, cinnamon an orange peel and um, some ginger so what you, you'll see that I've um, just mashed the ginger up All right. so I'm add that to it and I'm gonna Bring that to a boil for about 10 minutes and after 10 minutes I'm gonna let it simmer yeah so guys if you're new to the channel please subscribe to the channel like share and um, leave a comment all right I'm just gonna go in and give it another stir just to incorporate everything. As you can see. Yeah. So I want that to boil, come to a boil for 10 minutes. So your cinnamon sticks, your orange peel, your ginger, your high discus, everything start to come together. And once we get it to that boil, then we're gonna just turn our stove down and low and let it simmer for about 20, 25, 20, 25 minutes 
and then it should be done. And once that's done, we're gonna take it off and just leave it to cool. All right. So I'll come back in a minute once it start boil, just to show you the process of how I'm doing everything. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So guys, as you can see, the sorrel has come to a boil. Been going on like that for about 10, 10 minutes now, seven to 10 minutes. So I'm just gonna give it a, a stir. Yeah. Wow, the flavor. Mmm. You can see the cinnamon as well. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn it down. I'm gonna turn it down now and let it simmer for 20 to 25 minutes. So I'm gonna turn that on a low heat. So it just simmer for about 20 to 25 minutes. Alright? And then we'll check on it in between, but it shouldn't be for no more than 20 to 25 minutes. Alright, so I'll see you guys in a bit again when I'm gonna check on the soil. And guys, you don't have to use any alcohol if you don't want to. You don't have to use any rum. You don't have to use any wine. But for me, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use um some red label wine, some Rihanna for white rum. And that's and you can use a wine of your choice or the rum of your choice, you don't have to use this, but traditionally this is what we use in the Caribbean. So this is what I'm gonna continue to use. Alright. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So guys, we're back and it's about that time. Yep, exactly 25 minutes. I checked on it earlier so you can see it has actually darkened in color compared to when we just started and that smell that aroma Ooh. I wouldn't mind having some right now yeah so we're basically finished for now what we're gonna do we're gonna you know, turn the stove off. I'm gonna let this sit and cool. And then once it's cool, I'm gonna put it in the fridge for about probably about three, three to four hours. I mean, you can put it in there overnight. And I said, the longer you have it there, the longer it ferment, the longer all the flavors, everything come together. The better everything come together, the longer you have it. And then when you come back, we're gonna sweeten to taste, All right? And we're gonna add a, add some more water to it, depending on how it, how it is. Add some red label wine to it, some rum to it, and or sugar. So we're gonna sweeten to taste. Um, me personally, I don't like it when it's too sweet, so I like to dilute it not too sweet just the right taste for me and then can 
serve it with some ice you know, on Christmas day when you're having your Christmas dinner perfect all right so guys I'll see you when I'm gonna mix it sweeten it and add other stuff to it all right so until then see you in a bit all right guys welcome back so as you can see oh sorry let's finish yeah let's look at the cinnamon proper red mm, the ginger let me see if i find a piece of the ginger as well orange peel is red ginger is red So what we're gonna do now guys, we're just gonna strain strain the um sorry off because we don't want the trash to drink in it. So I'm just gonna strain it off and then um I'm gonna mix and sweeten. more water to it I'm gonna go back in again and this time I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna let it sit onto the bottom. So I'm just gonna pour from directly from the, the container itself, the pot. Careful because you don't want the trash to get inside there. Now nah, we have nothing today. time to sweeten as you can see but I'm gonna add some water to this because I know for a fact it is very strong yeah and <clears throat> don't remember when you sweeten it you don't have to add any alcohol to it you don't you can just add your sugar add some water and if you if you like it really strong then you don't have to add any anything to it any water to it you can just sweeten it and have it just like that but for me i'm gonna add some water to it and i'm gonna add some red label wine and some overproof rum yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead go, in, go ahead and pour in some um water That's two shots of sugar is mixed mix up thoroughly. There's no grain, there's nothing left inside. So 
So you just add the sugar bit by bit, you don't add all the sugar at the same time. So guys, that's pretty much it for the soil. You just need to just pour this into your container that you're gonna um, store it in. Put it in the fridge. Yeah, let it be, keep it chill. And then when you're serving, you serve with some with a glass of ice, and you're good to go. Enjoy it with the Christmas dinner, the Christmas cake. This is what Christmas is about, huh? This is what the season is about. Enjoy time with your family, you know? Time with your friend after a rough and long year. A nice drink to go down to wash down all that turkey, that chicken, you know, that goat meat, you know? The food of your choice, yeah? So guys, thanks for watching this video. And I'll see you again in my next video. Alright? Bye!